Also tonight, a disgusting discovery in Yuba County. Two badly mutilated dogs were found, and now investigators are trying to figure out if this is linked to dead dogs discovered in another location earlier this year. Bob Moffitt's live in Mar Marysville with the latest. Now, Bob? That's right, Stephanie. Nine dead dogs so far. Multiple agencies are investigating the discovery of these two dogs, trying to figure out if they have anything to do with the deaths of those dogs found starting in late summer. Investigators know some of the nine cases were criminal. This weekend's discovery in Marysville marked the first time that dogs have been found along the tracks outside of Linda, which is just across the East Street Bridge from Marysville. Investigators having a problem identifying the cause of death of three of the dogs here. The other four were shot to death. But are all of the cases criminal? At this point, it's too early in this latest investigation to determine that. Uh, we currently at this moment have the, uh, the two dogs that were located in Marysville. Uh, at a, uh, a vet, a uh, local vet. Uh, the dogs are being examined. We're trying to determine whether those dogs uh, had been shot or not. The way the dogs were positioned has raised suspicion. We certainly are looking into uh, what may be connections to uh, staging the dogs on the tracks, um, possibly after the dogs had been killed. So the city police and the county sheriff are working together. They're going to bring in a third law enforcement agency, and that is the railroad's law enforcement unit to see if they can help shed some light on what happened here. To see if they have any uh, video cameras or trains or on their trains, um, so to speak, that might have captured any video, or if they've had any trains um, travel through that area in the last 48 hours prior to the incident. Now, there is the very real possibility that the dogs who perished this weekend are like these two out and about with no one watching over them. There is actually um, a wide problem with dogs running around here, big dogs. Numerous dogs, actually. We're always worried that our dogs, when we let them out to go to the bathroom, something's going to happen to them. That preliminary investigation that the lieutenant spoke of was also inv involving x-rays. X-rays have just come back. Fox 40 has learned negative for any shrapnel or bullets. However, uh, detectives are not ruling out that these two deaths uh, may have uh, some relation to the other seven in the county. Thanks a lot, Bob Moffitt, live in Marysville tonight. We are learning more about.